guys and welcome back to my youtube channel today i have an accessory haul for you guys and i know i've been away forever but i thought what better way to come back than to just make a haul because that's what my subscribers love the most so today i purchased a lot of items from shein and i actually got them in 2020 but since all the links were still valid i was like okay like i could do a 2021 haul so yeah Everything I post and show today will be in the description of the box down below. And y'all, I spent a lot of money, a lot of money. So it's like, y'all better blow this video up because like at this point, she needs to sponsor me with the amount of money I give them. So the first thing I want to start off with is actually the sunglasses I bought. I bought a lot of them, so I'm just going to run through them really quick because y'all know I don't like long videos. So let's start so the first pair i'm gonna show is actually my favorite pair and it's these like black sunglasses y'all look at them like yes i put them on and just feel like a boss <laughs> like this is giving this is giving what it needs to give like do y'all see this yes like and i love how blacked out the frames are you guys because I really hate when you can see my eyes through sunglasses. Like I love when it's black like this, like this is perfect. Okay, so these next frames y'all, I can tell y'all they're not the best quality because I had actually ordered them before, but they had broke. Like I ordered them from Miami and they literally broke in Miami. So, but this is them. I really like these two. They're a bit big for my face, but it's really really cute and it's like a little ombre effect i love it. this next pair i got are these square green frames you guys and i actually got these in like two three different colors but i really like it only thing i do hate is that you can see my eyes through it and y'all know how i am about <sighs> y'all know how i am about that but it's a really cute frame i like it like I feel like I could wear it with green, like color block. No, you know, yeah, you get the vision. But yeah, I really like these. Y'all, this next pair, I feel like I could wear when I go like ATV riding or something. Like I really fuck with them. Like these are like some space, space, space vibes. Like, you know, I've been seeing this like type of sunglasses. It's really trendy right now. And I just think it's so cute. Like. It's literally like a shield, like, yes. I love it. Okay, so I don't know what I was really going for when I ordered these, you guys. I think I had a vision in mind and... <laughs> these literally look like... These look like science goggles. Like, I actually look like a construction worker. And they actually are useful because I use them to cut onions. That's actually, I won't even get into that. That's unimportant. But these, this is like probably the only pair I really didn't like because I don't know what I was expecting. But it's just giving very much like science lab. I don't know. Not fucking I love this next pair, you guys. This is like the other ones I showed y'all, but in white and the frames are blacked out. Look at this. It's really, really cute. I love it. It's this little square frame, black. What is this called? <sighs> That's embarrassing. But you get the gist, like these are nice. I really like these. Okay, this next pair y'all may have seen in my Shein Back to School haul, but they're actually not the same ones. Those were from Amazon and I actually lost them at a party. So I just decided to reorder some, but from Shein. And I will say the quality of these shades are really, really nice. Like, yes, I love them. And it actually goes with the top that I have on right now. Y'all can see, which this top is also from Shein. <laughs> but like Shein just needs to sponsor me they need to sponsor me at this point like everything Shein I'm not getting it but yeah 
these are like them 90s frames really cute and they actually have these in different colors but i just wanted the same ones that i have okay this next pair y'all i'm pretty sure i had seen them on like rihanna or something and i thought it would look good on my face but it just didn't like it's just way too big for my face i hate how see-through it is like i don't know i just i really don't like it on me but i think it's a cute pair of sunglasses i just don't think it's cute for me you know what i mean like it's just not meant for my face but they're okay like they're a little bit like holographic and stuff i don't know if y'all can see but it's a cool pair of sunglasses i like them this pair you guys is an everyday pair of sunglasses and i actually have got these from amazon before too but obviously i lost them as well in miami like i don't know miami was a mess but these y'all this is just the typical the typical bad bitch sunglasses like if you don't have these sunglasses i don't know what to tell you like this is the typical typical texas girl maybe it's texas thing because this is a typical sunglasses like you know like no makeup not trying to show my face sunglasses airport sunglasses beach sunglasses club sunglasses like this is that i feel like everybody needs this pair but these are like the only really big sunglasses i would really go for like i really like these on my face this next pair is all right to me again like once again y'all all the see-through sunglasses i wasn't really feeling like that i just feel like they don't go well with my face and if y'all see me keep looking this way it's because there's a mirror right there but you know what i mean like i like the detail on it though but it's just i really don't like them at least not for me like nah it's I'm not messing with it like that, but it's cool. I just think the sides are cute. It's like a little Versace knockoff, <laughs> but yeah, it's last pair I got is similar to the other two pairs, but I got it in nude and I actually really love these. You guys, the frames aren't too dark and you can sort of see my eyes, but it's still perfect. Like I really like these a lot like this type of nude yes it can even go with this like this is really really cute y'all i love it I could wear them anyhow but i just really love these frames all right so the next things i want to show y'all is all the jewelry i got i actually got more than what i'm about to show but i've already worn them like i said i purchased all these items in 2020 so i've worn some of these but I already worn some of them and some of them broke or whatever. So whatever I show y'all is just what I have. So the first things I got were these earrings and they actually came in, they actually both came together. And I really, really, really love these y'all. Like I love these earrings. They're actually beautiful and they're actually really heavy y'all. Like it feels like quality, but I really cannot wait to wear these earrings and style them like I love them and I can say for the silver I know they're not gonna rust because she and silver y'all does not rust their gold rust as soon as it's out the pack but their silver will last the next piece I got is just this bracelet and I think it's so cute I don't know if you guys can see but it's like really really cute like just a cute little accessory i love it so the next piece i got y'all that i've been wearing a lot is this cuban and cubans are really hot right now you guys but let me just show you guys how it looks only thing i don't like about it is that it's not a cuban all the way like it stops right there but for the most part it's really cute like i love it it shines and I've had this for like a while you guys and it has not rusted so it held up pretty well so that's that and the last piece of jewelry I got you guys is just this obviously I got S for Shade Slim Shady all of that and this is also very cute I don't know if y'all could see but I've had this for a while it has not rusted either so yeah this is actually one of the favorite ones that I bought and it's double layered, just like that, just like that. Okay, now it's time for the first of y'all. And I got 
a lot of purses. Let me just tell y'all, like, I got a lot. So, sit tight. I'm gonna run through this. So, I'm gonna start with my favorite piece. And it's this cow bag. And y'all know, y'all know me and cow print are like this. Do y'all know? I don't know if y'all know, but... Just know me and cow print are like this. Like anything cow print, I love. So I really love this bag. And it's even not like the regular black and white cow print. It's like the, has spots of brown. Like it looks really, really real and expensive. So I really, really love this bag. It's so cute. And it's like has more of a gold tone. They actually have like so many different kinds of the cow prints. But I just really like this one because of like the expensive look it gave. Okay, so this next bag I got, y'all, is so freaking cute. Like, I can't wait to wear this spring break. Like, I just really love this bag. Like, it's perfect for the beach, I feel like. It's clear, has this little button in the front. It opens up like this. So I'm about to hold these down. You know what, y'all? You're supposed to open it by pressing the buttons, but I don't know why I'm having a really hard time, but y'all get the gist. But the scarf is removable. Like, you can remove the scarf and put it in the bag or put it however you want, but I just wrapped it around it because I really like that look. So I don't know what I was really thinking when I ordered this bag, but... I don't know. I wasn't really feeling it when I saw it. Like, I guess I was expecting it to be bigger, but it's all right. Like, I think the inside is cool. Like, it's drawstring. It's like a drawstring bag inside, so I thought that was cool and stuff, but I don't know. Like, the bag is quite odd. Like, I don't, I really don't understand what I was thinking when I ordered this bag, y'all. Like, but here it is. <laughs> This next bag, if y'all follow me on Instagram, y'all probably already seen it on my story. It's this little jersey bag, saddle bag. Y'all, I love it. Like, I'm really into saddle bags right now. Because, you know, Dior saddle bags, I can't afford them right now. But we fake it till we make it. But this is really cute. Like, it's really different. I really think that this was like a hit or a miss. But, like, at first I wasn't feeling it. But I really love it. It's literally so cute. So I just feel like I needed some classy bags, y'all, because I really don't have any purses. So some of the purses y'all gonna see are like this. Just really some classy bags. They're not really that in anymore, but I still got them in like so many different colors. But y'all like the quality feels amazing. Like it's actually like pretty thick and stuff. And I think the little locket is so cute. And I love the color, this little mustard yellow color. But yeah, that's that. One of my favorite pieces is this cute little brown bag, y'all. It goes with my little fit. Yes, I'm really into browns, as you can tell. And, yeah, it says Jin, Jink Pin Bag or something like that on it. I don't know. I don't care. But it's really, really cute. Like, I love it. Cute little brown bag, y'all. And it's so tiny. Like, some of these bags are actually really small, but it's really cute, right? Just carry some lip gloss in there. This next bag I got, y'all, is actually similar to that. It's this green one. And I really feel like my favorite thing about this bag is the handle. Like, it's odd, but it's cute. Like, I really love this bag. And it's similar to that one, except it's not snakeskin and it's green. And the handle is like this, like, I don't know how to explain it, but I think it's so cute. Like, this is definitely a must-have. And this one says fashion and trend. But it's really cute. The next bag I got is this basic white bag. And yeah, it's just something basic. Like, you know, once again, I told y'all, I don't, I had like no bags. So I ordered just a bunch of bags that I think I would need and stuff. But this is just a basic one, white and gold. Also, like, I don't know. It's hard to figure out how to open these bags, y'all. Like, I promise you, I'm not an idiot. I just... These are really complicated bags. Like, anything with these, I don't know how to open it. Chien, I don't know how to open these because I don't know what that is, y'all. Like, I really don't. But, yeah, I can't get it open. But that's that. Like, it is so cute. I don't know what I'm going to wear it with, y'all. But it is so 
cute and that's this this isn't even the cutest part like look at this when you open it up you guys velvet you can't tell me that is not cute like that is so freaking cute i really love it like i don't know what i'm gonna wear this with i don't really have lavender or i don't know but this is a really cute bag you guys it's really boxy and stuff like i don't know i love it this next bag i got y'all it's like just this regular old side bag and i got this just because it's cute and it's blue and i don't have no blue bags but i think it's so cute i think it's really cute how like the early 2000s fashions are coming back like these are the type of bags they used to wear back then i love how it's coming back but yeah this is like just something basic that i got from there so this next bag i got you guys is this little denim bag and i'm sure y'all seen it before it's a really popular piece from there it's really cute only thing i will say is that it's just so much smaller in person like i expected it to be way bigger and this is like the handle that you like just clip on here and stuff. I don't know if I will, but I think it's really cute. Like, it literally just says Pandola bag on it, but it's cute. It's a cute little piece Wear it with some denim. But yeah, this is, that's that. Okay, this next bag I got y'all is also cow print. I couldn't help myself. Like, it's so look at it look at this you guys like the brown is just so cute on it like i really love it it's so tiny like it's really really small like, i feel like it looks bigger on camera but y'all like look at the size of my hand and look at the bag like it's actually so tiny but it's so cute i really love this bag Uh, this next bag I got is like another anti bag, y'all. Like, once again, I don't feel like these are that in anymore, but like, I just had to do what I had to do. And this is like some cute bag. The pink is giving me very much spring, very much brunch. I like it. Classy girl vibes. And the last and final bag I got. I think this is the final one. Yeah, this is the last and final bag, y'all. And it's just this basic black bag, you guys. Nothing too special. Just a black bag that I needed with like gold hints on it. But yeah, it's really cute. And, stuff. and this is adjustable. You can pull it out, make it longer. Or you can wear it like this. So that's really cool about the bag. All right, you guys, that is it for my haul. Thank you so, so much for tuning into my video, y'all. I know it's been a long, long time, but I plan to push out a lot more hauls for y'all, a lot more videos in 2021. Um, I'm actually going to film a Get Ready With Me like next week or two weeks. I don't want to promise anything, and I'll explain why I've been gone. But till then, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.